And this year I have Marley here, hearing loss, and then this year I have severe profound hearing loss. I have a mild to moderate hearing loss. I wear hearing aids to help me hear, but I also be lip. I speak sign language. People with normal hearing can just hear and they take it for granted because it's just one of the five senses, you know. Not a lot of people know about hearing loss. People think that it happens in elderly people. I think it's really neat to be here with a bunch of other kids my age who have experienced the same thing. I was usually the only one with a hearing loss, so I... The problem is nobody understands what to do to support me, to communicate with me. But a lot of people I hang out with are completely deaf or completely hearing, so they don't get it. And this is the first time I'm actually with a group who experienced things that I do, and I didn't realize how badly I need a group that I can actually relate to and talk to. Because you can't hear it doesn't mean you can't do something that everyone else does. We wait while we're masking, we are jumping off boats and paddling boats and camping in the wildlife. We really are actually going to be helping um, collect data that's going to be incorporated into a management plan the park is working on right now. It's picking up sound. Uh, this is a listening activity. That is so yeah. cool. When I first just came here, I felt like I was at home. I mean, everybody's like my family. I'm comfortable with my hearing loss now. On this trip, I really want to impact something, do something, affect people. And not just sit home and watch other people do that. I want to be the person changing. Just because you are disabled somehow does not mean you cannot do something.